Yeah, but I can't walk without it, can I? No, yeah, like I can, but I can't put my right leg in front, right? Like I can walk, walk, yes, that's fine. I'm gonna ask difficult questions yeah. and you're going to get frustrated. Okay. And that's what this is about today. And I don't want you to feel like I'm attacking you. No, 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 that's fine. I understand. It's all out of care. Yeah. And I appreciate that. And I also don't want you to feel like I'm psychoanalyzing you because <laughs> I'm studying. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh, just do that right. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. All right, what's next? <sighs> Have you explained what FND is? So this is what this is doing. Yeah, it's showing you that you can do it no matter what your brain thinks. Yes. Yes. Can I explain the internal pathway to you? Yes. So your dissociative episodes. We have something that's called a default network. And that's our internal thoughts. That's where we live, like when we're thinking about ourselves, when we're thinking about threats and what we're perceiving. Then we have our frontal network, which is your automatic, let's go, I don't have to think about walking network. Then you have one in between that likes to connect or disconnect. And it's not doing its job for people with FND. So you're in your default network or your dopey network. That's what you're feeling when you're you can't comprehend what's going on because you're basically like... It would have exerted myself too much. Yes. 